title of this email What supplements get rid of muscle soreness? What the fuck? Obviously, you don't know what the fuck you talking about. Supplements that get rid of muscle soreness? Who the fuck told you was such a thing? <laughs> Obviously, somewhere, somewhere, yeah. somebody said, hey, man, I take this supplement. It gets rid of my muscle soreness. Or it prevents muscle soreness. Where'd you get that, man? Yeah, who the fuck told you that? Did you have a fucking dream or something, man? <laughs> who told you that tale? <laughs> hmm? Did the Bro Science Association down at the gym tell you that shit? It's not a such thing. That only exists in a fairy tale. Hey, harsh twins. I'm doing a push pull leg split. Been doing it for three weeks now. I just started training. This shit is fucking chicken scratch. Man, fuck it. No, just throw it down, man. He sent a picture. Look at him. You skinny mother. Man, come on, man. What? Dude, just started. You remember what the fuck we look like? Goddamn string beam. <laughs> Big ass fucking heads. Had some T Rex action. Now, I got some Beetlejuice action. Head small as fuck. No, lean your head back like this. Make your head look even smaller. Bro, you just for it. Yeah, look, small. look. You look big as fuck when you do this. <laughs> God damn, look how small his head is. <clears throat> anyway, fellas, I'm so tired of this muscle sore. As soon as I get <clears throat> my back, as soon as my back is not sore, my chest is sore. As soon as my chest is not sore, my arms are sore. When I get over my damn legs soreness, everything else is sore. It's just... It's just Nerve racking when I'm in the gym, hitting other body parts. And oh, other it's parts your fucking my, job or when you're on top of your girl, man. And other body parts are still sore. How? What can I buy or take to get rid of this and to help alleviate this problem? Yeah, if I was, if I had a, a low morale, <coughs> not morale, if I had a, a that's where I'm looking for, um, fuck it. If I was a no good son of a bitch. I would tell you to go to my website and buy all my supplements. But I'm not going to do that. You know That's, why? Because I'm trustworthy. <laughs> I'm a man of my word. Look here. Like when I first started training, I used to think soreness was yeah. a sign of having an effective workout. It's right. not actually a sign of um, just completing an effective it, workout. It's it a may sign. be an indication that you're new to training. Fuck Which, you. It might be an indication if you're new to training. If you first start working what? out, how the fuck you gonna steal my goddamn thunder again, bitch? How the fuck I knew you was gonna say I, that? I was. I had a goddamn punchline coming, bitch. Let me start this shit over. Training, I mean soreness, is not a sign of effective training. It is a sign, yeah, of not training frequently enough. Yeah, that's what soreness is. Yeah, it's a sign. Yeah. Of not training frequently enough. For example, if you hit, he said he's doing a, a push pull leg day, right? Push pull split. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So push day, you're doing bench press, shoulder press, all pressing movements, right? No shit. You say you do that on Monday. You he didn't say that. He just said it. I'm just saying, for example, this is how you should be training. You hit it on Monday, you should rest. And do that same uh, routine again on Thursday. You should rest it Tuesday and Wednesday. You can rest Thursday and hit that same routine on Friday. But once you do a routine, whether it's push, pull, or leg, you should at least give that body part about 72 hours of training. If you hit it... For 72 hours of training? 72 hours of rest. Man, get this fucking shit right, man. <laughs> if you, you want 48... If, you, if you've not... Training and doing that same routine frequently enough, if you're waiting five, six, seven days before you do that same routine again, whether it's push, pull, or leg day, you're going to be sore. Let me clean this fucking shit up. That's what I This told. motherfucker's all discombobulated now, bitch. After you hit that muscle group, you want to rest it 48 to 72 hours, and then you want to hit it again. Yeah. That's what the fuck you was trying to say. That's what if I told you. If you're waiting five, six, six. Seven days. You hitting that body part once a damn week. When you yeah. hit it again, yeah. it's going to be sore again because you ain't training frequently enough. So, bam. Here's your routine. Monday, push day. Two, 
Tuesday, pool day, three legs, four rest, or you can repeat day one. Yeah. At least try to take That a- is in layman turn. I take a day off a week. You yeah. get one rest day. Yeah. And you got to watch. I ain't going to say that. I ain't going to give you too much information. But you should be fine with that. Yeah, train more frequently and that soreness will go away. Yeah. You have little aches, little, like, you know, just a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Just, just a little bit. Yeah. Just a little bit. I mean, you ain't going to be bitching and complaining. Yeah. You hit legs one time a week, every week, you're going to be limping the whole fucking week. Yeah, fuck that. Because you're not training your legs frequently enough. Yeah. All this is just advice, though. That's all it is, man. Do up it all. Fuck you want to do.